In this experiment, you'll be using Hooke's law to measure the constant of an actual spring. A spring has a relaxed length when no force is applied to it. Hooke's law says that when a spring is compressed or stretched by an amount x away from this relaxed length, it will respond with a restoring force that is linearly proportional. The proportionality constant k in this equation is also called the spring stiffness constant. If we attach a known mass to a spring, we can calculate the applied force and measure the extension of the spring. Hooke's law says the relationship between these two quantities should be linear, but is it? Let's experiment and find out. Here we have some 50 gram masses and a hanger that also masses 50 grams. Here's our setup. Spring hangs from a hook on this vertically mounted ruler, and we can attach our mass hanger to the other end and add additional masses to it, and then measure the extension of the spring. No measurement is perfect. The needle will never be completely steady, so we'll have to make our best guess as to what the position is. This illustrates why you should also always provide an uncertainty to describe how accurate your measurements are. In this case, we give a plus or minus distance from our measured value where we're pretty confident the needle spends most of its time.